And here in Missouri, the state health department is already testing some samples for the new variant of the virus. ABC 17's Connor Hirsch checked in with the state's public health laboratory today. He joins us live outside our station. And Connor, when someone tests positive for COVID-19, it takes longer to determine if it's the new variant. And Deb Lucas, any normal PCR testing you can have done here in Min, Missouri will tell you if you have either variation of the virus, but the state is taking extra steps to know when and if this new variation makes it to Missouri. We certainly want to get ahead of the curve on this so we can have more public health mitigation efforts to make sure that we don't have more illness, more morbidity and more mortality in the state than we already have with the current strain. While early data shows this new variant isn't more deadly and doesn't cause more severe symptoms, director of the state public health lab Bill Whitmar said it's believed to be about 70 percent more easily spread. And maybe this, this variant will come in and be more prevalent or within a few months maybe it'll come out of, of, of prevalence. So the only time will tell but it seems to be that at this point in time that it may become a, a prevalent strain. But this doesn't mean every sample in the state will be tested for this variant. Boone Hospital told me it's continuing to test as normal. And Gene Trait Labs in Columbia said it's not testing for the variant right now. The state lab only does up to about 800 tests per day out of the thousands done by hospitals and commercial companies in Missouri. But the state lab is currently working on expanding its capacity to test for this variant. Well, it's not as easy, but we still do the test, uh, utilize the same test. It's just a little bit more work for us to do. State Health Director Dr. Randall Williams said the current vaccines will likely fight this strain. They're looking at uh, whether or not the vaccine would cover it. Intuitively, we think it would, but we've got to prove that. And here in Columbia, the Boone Columbia Health Department told me that they are not aware of any sites that are currently testing for this new variant in the area, but they are going to continue to monitor any new information about it from the CDC and the state. Reporting live in Columbia, Connor Hirsch, ABC 17 News. Thank you, Connor. The state is currently sending about 25 tests per week to the CDC as part of a nationwide surveillance effort for this new variant.